And as you can see right here, our big story this Tuesday morning, the water main break here on Frank Road, live pictures this morning. Uh, again, water shooting nearly 50 feet into the air. And, a local, and of course, uh, this actually happening here uh, on Frank Road. Harmon Elementary School is right nearby here in the Southwestern City School District. And we have word from the school officials there that uh, the, the school is closed this morning. Of course, we'll have much more on this coming up throughout the morning. Thanks so much for joining us on this Tuesday, February 24th. I'm Chuck Strickler. And I'm Angela Ann. We have learned that AEP crews are on their way to this scene, and there are also water crews that just arrived trying to contain this situation. But again, there are some roads in that area shut down, and we want to get to Karina Nova right now with more on the traffic situation caused by this water main break. Karina? Good morning. Yeah, Frank Road eastbound is closed at Harrisburg Pike. It's going to be tough to get through that area. So I'll give you some good alternates in just a second, but we want to go back out there. These pictures are amazing. We've never seen anything like it. And Steve Harvey, our photographer, has been there for quite a while now shooting this video for us. We want to talk to him because crews are just getting to the scene to take care of this. Steve, can you tell us more? Oh, Karina, this is a huge mess out here. This arrow board was actually here yesterday as I drove by this area. And what it is, is actually as I'm panning down here, there's a construction site that they've actually cut in the road. To the one side, there's a water main and it has broken and is shooting water 20, 30, 40, 50 feet up in the air onto this gigantic pine tree and on the wires. One of the problems, as I'm showing you right now, the wires have started to come down. This one came down a little while ago. You can see it. It's covered with ice and buried in the ice. The biggest issue is now how to get it turned off, get to the water main and turn off. Eastbound from Harrisburg Pike is closed. It is very icy out here. Police have already uh, actually have one person they've given a ticket to for going the wrong way and going through the uh, the. Uh, police barricades, but as you can see there are the crews are starting to arrive to try and figure out how to get this water main shut off. It will be a while. It will cause a lot of problems for people in the area with water. I'm sure there will be boil alerts, but this is going to be a mess for some time. Karina? Thank you very much, Steve. And it looks like that tree's getting frozen over, too. So trees, wires, this is going to be a big deal all morning long. We'll check back on that shortly. Just want to give you a quick uh, alternate for that. You could take Big Run Road and Hopkins Avenue. That'll get you around it. But once again, like Steve said, they did give someone a ticket. Avoid that area if you can. Angela and Chuck, back to you. All right. Thanks so much, Karina. We do want to um, get now to the... Central Ohio's News Leader. Presented in high definition, this is 10 TV News HD. Welcome back. Look at these live pictures from the scene of a water main break that we've been following all morning long. This along Frank Road in South Columbus, where crews have just now shut off the water near Harmon Elementary School, right there where the cones are. We are told that Harmon Elementary is closed for today because of this watery and icy situation. Thanks so much for staying with us at 6.30 on this Tuesday morning. I'm Angela Ann. And I'm Chuck Strickler. We continue to follow this breaking news again. Our photographer, Steve Harvey, has been on the scene all morning long since soon after this first happened. And he joins us now live with the new information. Those crews capping things off there right now, Mike, or Steve, huh? Hey, Chuck, there is good news and not so good news. The good news is the water has been shut off. What happened was over the weekend, there was a water main break right here at this spot. They got it capped. Everything was fine. But this morning around 5 o'clock, it broke open again. As you can see, the crews are trying to move the signboards. What they're presently doing is trying to get these signboards moved so they can open up in the next 20 to 30 moment, minutes, both eastbound and westbound, one lane of Frank Road. Now, let me take you back a few moments ago where I have shot some pictures where I went across the street and got up close to the water main break. You see there is pouring out is going about 40, 50 feet up into the air onto the high wire. That is going to be the big issue. The wires have got a lot of ice on them, and these higher wires that you are looking at or have seen are covered with ice. If they snap because of the weight of the ice, it's going to cause a great deal of uh, problems for the people trying to fill in the uh, water main uh, hole and fix and repair the line below. 
Uh, back out here live, you can see them moving the signs uh, again as they're putting up the new boards. They have come out with the salt truck to uh, put salt on this very icy area. The other issue, the good news, they got the water shut off. The bad news is everybody in this area from here back to the west to Harrisburg Pike are going to be out of water. Now water is going to be an issue. They already have Harmon Elementary School closed. And as you can see, the ice sitting on the wires way up high, 40, 50 feet up in the air as, this, as crews continue to try and get this situation under control. Chuck? All right, thanks, Steve. And just again, anybody out of power in that area, Steve, because of those sagging lines at this point that you know? I have not seen any houses. Oh, there goes a wire just now. If you saw it, a wire just right. came down. And there's another one. There's another wire that was loose right there. It just fell. You see a second wire? Yeah, we can see it's shaking there, Steve. Right in there. See the wire right there on the ground? It just fell. Now, those are cable and TV and phone lines. The higher one's up. Let me show you. The higher one's up, way up there. Those are the electric wires. They're the ones that they're concerned of falling down on crews that will be working below. As for electricity, uh, as I look around, there are lights on throughout the neighborhood, but the water's going to be out and people are going to be waking up to no water. Chuck? All right, thanks so much. Photographer Steve Harvey live on the scene. Steve, thanks so much for that uh, perspective out there. And once again, we want to remind you that Harmon Elementary School is closed today because of the water main break and all the resultant cleanup that they're going to be having to do there today, of course. And there's also a traffic situation right along Frank Road with all that water coming out for about an hour and 20 minutes. Icy conditions there. Yeah, the salt trucks are out there trying to salt those roads and get that ice melted. But here's Karina Nova with your progressive traffic update. Karina. Good morning. Yeah, crews closed off Frank Road eastbound through that area because they need that space to clear all of that ice and, of course, that water main break, get that taken care of. So once again, Frank Road eastbound is closed off at Harrisburg Pike. If you're heading that way, you could take a couple good alternates. You could take Big Run, or you can also take Hopkins Avenue. That'll get you around it. Just avoid that area if you can so you don't have to deal with all of that. The rest of your roadways are looking good right now. Let's see how we're looking in the weather department. You can see that map right there that's showing the closure. But let's check in now with Mike Davis to talk about the weather. Mike, it is cold out there. Yeah, that is the main issue, the fact that it's so far below freezing, well below average for this time of year. We've been hovering at the airport at 14 degrees.